So for you, your dad gave you your competitive fire. Mm -hmm. How so? Um, I think you know since I was little, we used to just go at it in like every sport. Um, and uh, be like until my brothers got older, it would be me playing against him one on one, and uh, he would never let me win. Like <laughs> as as hard as I would try and like as much as I would cry, um, whether it was football, we were playing one on one, one lacrosse, one on one basketball. He would always win, and I would always throw a fit. So from when I was little, I just hated to lose. Your assist totals in high school are actually like laughable, like 400 plus assists. Where's the vision come from? For me, it just comes from understanding the game um, and being around the game for so long. And um, you know, growing up with my dad as a coach, uh, I was able to like understand the X's and O's side of things. And I think that with that. Um, you know, sometimes you can predict things before they happen and you can see things. But also from, from playing other sports, like uh, I grew up playing basketball and in basketball I, I could never shoot. Um, Bad jumper? Yeah, horrible jumper. <laughs> so I had to learn how to pass at a young age. When I watch you play on the field, things oftentimes look easy. Defenders look like they're in slow motion. So when you step on this field, what's the first thing that comes to mind? I always try and like think about the tradition here and we run on this way and you run right towards the national championship banners and Ivy League championship banners um, and it just kind of reminds you like where you are and, and who you're really playing for. I mean the program is so much bigger than just the team that is on the field. Where's your favorite spot on the field here? Right like right behind that X. Yeah that's where you do your work yeah. right? When we spoke earlier three players that came to mind, guys that you really watched in terms of their craft on the field, attackmen, Mikey Powell, Jordan Wolf, Joey Sankey. When I say each player's name, tell me one piece of their game that you have in your game. Mikey Powell. Vision. Jordan Wolf. Uh, quickness. Joey Sankey. His toughness. You're a huge Birds fan, huh? Yeah, big Birds fan. Dude, you're Philly tough, yeah. huh? The same passion I have for lacrosse, I share with football, and um, it's just been a huge part of my life. You were a D-back, right? Mm -hmm. Shutdown corner? Uh, try to be more of like You a, have the uh, feet of a shutdown corner. Yeah. Um, I mean, I try to be. I always try to match up with the best receiver. Did you talk smack? Uh, in football, I did a little you bit. You did? Yeah. What kind of stick do you use? Um, this is this is like my backup. I use Evo, just like same stringing every time, same guy strings it. Are you particular about it? Really particular. I, How so? I, I can't use like um, like if I'm like playing around, like I can yeah. only use my sticks. It's really? like a mental thing for me. How do you get them strung? Uh, like a little bit of whip, but like you can feel the thing coming out. Sweet. Individually, for Michael Sowers. What do you want to get out of 2018? Um, you know, for me personally, uh, I think that there's no like greater award in lacrosse, obviously, than the Tour Time. So, um, just to be able to compete for that and um, hopefully end up uh, in DC for that ceremony. And I think that, um, you know, for me, that's my individual goal, and um, that's what I'm striving for. Knowing your mindset, knowing how hard you work, and knowing your skill. I think I'd put a wager on you. Thank you.